welcome back to my channel hello from bangladesh i have not been here in 20 years my mom also has not been here since 2004 with us so it's so surreal for her to like see everything and she's like telling us where she went to school where she used to play and things like that like i cannot imagine being away from my home for that long of a period so it's such a big deal and i've been wanting to come back for years and years so this is like such an exciting feeling i'm here with my brother and my mom it was like a 20 hour flight We got a lot of food on the Emirates flight, so slay, because they really racked it up with all the food, like multiple course meals for each meal, like three meals for a 12 hour flight and then our layover and then our next flight and things like that. So we were good in that aspect, but it's such a long plane ride. It's also like a an 11 hour time difference in Bangladesh. So it's just, you know, a little bit of an adjusting that we have to do. This is the fit check. Obviously I'm wearing my own designs, labyrinthive.com, a little maxi dress. It's like 80 degrees here and very humid. The air quality is not the best. <laughs> it was very hard to like sleep and get adjusted to the air quality because you start getting like a sore throat right away. But you know what? We're gonna get adjusted. I'm just grateful to be here and just experience life just because I've been wanting this moment for so long. And I'm really excited to like take you guys along with me. You know, we're gonna hang out with family and eat food and go to all the fairs and things like that. But I'm also here for a specific reason. And I'm very excited to show you guys what that is in a few days. We're gonna go out to eat some breakfast and just dilly dally today. This is the look, just you know, my casual earrings from Florida. I have just simple makeup on. I made sure to put on some setting spray so that hopefully it stays in place with this humidity. But yeah, I'm gonna try my best to vlog. It is a little bit hard to talk here just because the noise level is crazy. And also we're staying at my uncle's house and they have a whole family, so I don't wanna like intrude. But let's get started on this beautiful trip. Crossing the street. No one's stopping for us. Is one of the biggest like the. the biggest South Asian stores in Bangladesh. Oh, it's okay. This is my outfit today. Red and traditional wear. I love this outfit so much. Like I haven't worn it in years, but I wear it every chance I get. But yesterday was our first day like officially having the whole day to ourselves. And it was so nice. My partner and I, we matched up our trips. So we had like one day of alignment. So I saw him, I saw his mom and it was just great. We had food, we went shopping and you know, I had a roller coaster of a ride in the CNG. They have no traffic laws here. So it is such a adrenaline rush and um, a thrilling rush. That is very scary every single time but they make do and this is how the country runs so it's whatever and also today we're doing something very exciting we're doing a lot of like the historical things and like actually sightseeing and that's one of the main reasons why i came because like i want to actually learn about my country and like see all the things that make it so great instead of just like shop and eat which obviously are also great things so i think today we're going to go to the national museum and just learn about the history we're gonna try to go to like Dhaka University and like maybe my mom's college and just like sightsee around you know like the campus and the dorms and everything just to see where she went and my uncles and stuff where they went and we also want to go to the book fair so the entire month of February there's something called the boy mela which translates to book fair and it's literally the entire month and it's like the start of the spring kind of and this is like a big deal in Bangladesh that's why everyone comes around this time and they all go to this place around the university during this time just to be around all the books and all the culture and all the events and things like that so it's like all around the same area so let's see what we get to today because I feel like we're very ambitious today we have a lot of things to do so I doubt we're gonna get to everything but regardless let's see also a lot of you guys 
are in Bangladesh. Like when I posted my first reel and TikTok and everything of me being here, I got so many DMs and comments. I think the most I've ever gotten for me to like host a meetup and like meet up with people personally, which obviously I can't do because I have such a short amount of time here. And it was very like overwhelming because I didn't expect that. Like I know a very big demographic of mine lives here. But I didn't realize it was that big. So that's good to know for next time when I come because I would love to meet some of you guys and I know it would be amazing. But yeah, I have to eat because I'm so freaking hungry. I'm still trying to get accustomed to the time shift, the time difference. Yeah, let's get the day started. And also I have to open up my laptop for the first time in like four or five days because work does not stop. A little moment of silence for this beautiful dress. <laughs> Honestly, New York could never because look how safe this train is. And constantly being clean too. It's just like London. I can't relate, man. I've never been there. Don't know, but we're known for the music out here. New collection inspo. This is a new technology. The threads are made from like banana, banana leaves. My whole last collection was inspired by this type of embroidery. It's so crazy to see it in real life. Like, look at that individual stitching. Can you imagine if you fell like in the middle of the night? Shohin Minor, which is our national <laughs> monument. Alright, this is the final outfit for today. Very simple vibes, not gonna wear heels or sandals today because that was not working for me yesterday from all the walking and like the dirt and everything. But today we are going to the Ultra Youth office, which is a little bit further in to the main city. And if you guys don't know what Ultra Youth is, it's basically the organization that I'm working with who is providing like all of these scholarships for kids in Bangladesh. And we're gonna go talk to them in person and just like meet the whole team, which is so exciting. I also tried heatless curlers today because I finally washed my hair 
and it kind of looks good now that it's like drying up, but we'll see how the humidity treats it. See here, you can actually cross the street normally. afternoon from Bangladesh today we are doing a little bit of shopping and like souvenirs I don't know why but it's like not a thing to have souvenir shops here you know in like New York Europe anywhere really there's like stores where you can buy like cups mugs magnets keychains things like that they don't have that here like you gotta go deep into actual stores and try to find those things so it's gonna be a hunt trying to find things for myself and like my friends and family back home so let's hope that today we actually find something I'm wearing my first pair of jeans today with this outfit and yesterday was such a good experience oh my god meeting the ultra youth team you know the team that provides all these scholarships that i'm working with and seeing them in person going to their office and just like learning more about them and their mission was so fulfilling and i'm so excited to show you guys like why i really came to bangladesh and that's going to be in a whole other vlog just because it deserves it the why i'm coming here has been like a lifelong dream of mine and i'm like so excited to show you guys and like my mom and brother were there to like really take it in and to see like what i do so it was really cool meeting with them we went to their house and then they showed us around bangladesh and we went to this like very elite club called Uttar club and we had a lot of safe street food um options so that was really nice to have them as a little like tour guide also we went to this area called gulshan and if you guys saw the transition in the video it was like not as populated and busy anymore it was a lot easier to drive the traffic was not crazy at all there was actually like street lanes like lines on the streets to drive properly and it reminded me of like beverly hills rodeo drive from la because that's what it looked like it was very hilly the upscale people live there the international students live there you know the business diplomatic the fathers live there and things like that so it was a very big shift from like what i was used to here it was crazy but i got bit by a lot of mosquitoes I'm breaking out right here mosquito bite up here all up on my ankles so it's a whole thing oh and yesterday yeah I ate actually like three meals the past few days I've been sleeping bad and also I've been eating just one meal just because you know the time difference and if one meal is bad it ruins my whole appetite I don't feel like eating anymore but yesterday we actually ate like a good amount and like good food let's keep the streak running hopefully this is an outfit check for today very simple very casual just gonna put on some sneakers this top is actually my mom's from years ago like she threw it out and I found it out of wherever she put it and so she's kind of mad at me for wearing such an old top but gotta wear it for the sentimental reasons you know at least he's not bald not the Tom and Jerry store with those baby suits <laughs> currently at Eden College, which is my mom's yes. alma mater. How do you feel? Oh, I feel it. very excited. <laughs> this is a little tour of the school. Yeah. After 20 plus years, we're meeting up with her friends from 28 years ago. How do you not see your friend for 28 years? That's crazy. I can't even go like a week without seeing one. Queen behavior only. What are you talking my mom used to swim in this lake when it was filled with water 
It's pretty deep and big. My brother just finally found a basketball court for the first time. Yeah. Complaints? University kids are out right now. If you guys didn't know, the schools here are closed on Friday and Saturday. That's her weekend. It starts back up on Sunday. So the roads were kind of clear in the morning, but now it's back to being crowded because people are chilling for the book fair. <laughs> we're crossing the street at night today. because in between we actually went to a village and I'm so excited to show you guys like why we went there you'll see that in the next vlog but basically I'll give you a hint we went to the village to 
look at some of the kids that we provide scholarships for. So we had to take a whole plane and drive four hours. It was like a whole ordeal and it was like the most fulfilling thing that I've ever done. So I'm so excited for you to see that whole thing next week. But anyway, we're back in the main city of Taka and this is outfit today very comfortable cotton material very flowy like this is exactly what i came here for to shop for these type of clothing but i have a sore throat and my nose is running because first of all my, my brother has been sick and also second just going back and forth from like different temperatures because the village that we went to was a little bit colder and just like you know food and like whatever it is has made me like a little bit sick thankfully i don't have food poisoning as of yet and hopefully not so i'm like counting my blessings and i think i'm at that point of the trip where i'm like mentally checked out like i haven't done work yet i haven't had like alone time yet i haven't had time to just like sleep in my own bed obviously like in the travel for this long so I think like just need time to like recuperate. But anyway, if you guys have been liking this video so far, please make sure to like and subscribe because it helps so much. I'm trying my best to edit out here, even though I don't have much time and space or internet, <laughs> but I want to deliver it for you guys so I can kind of stay on schedule and I'm not too backed up when I go back to New York. But when I do go back to New York, I have like a few days of rest and then I have my first ever bachelorette trip that I'm going to in New Orleans. And then when I come back, it's gonna be basically like Ramadan and I'm gonna be fasting. So it's gonna be all these things at the same time. But yeah, today we are going to some historical sites. We're going to the Asa Monzil like building. It's like a historical site. And then and we're meeting one of our cousins for the first time. So let's see how everything goes. But first, my mom has to make some like custom clothing before we head back because they know what they're doing here and it's also a lot cheaper so people usually give us like whoever's going to their home country we give them like clothing to make so for us we got all this clothing from like our family and stuff and we have to make it and then bring it back but we only have three days left so hopefully they're able to like make it on time but anyway this is gonna be a longer vlog because i don't want to divide this video up into two parts and make you guys wait i hope you guys have been liking it so far My mom came matching with me today. <laughs> she wanted to twin with me so bad. How about you? Eyes. Your eyes still irritated? Not so much. Let me see the red eye. I got a mosquito bite right here. took a break yesterday because I was so sick but at least I was able to do some work and edit for like 10 plus hours but I'm still sick as you can hear but took some pictures in the new collection gonna change and go god knows where today basically our last full day here so let's see Not the scariest shit that you've ever seen in your life. Let me right see. There. Oh, he got bit. <laughs> right there. Oh, there's another one. Look, it's his friend. He killed him. It was in my shirt. He killed the mosquito. Where's the other one? 
Oh, there it is, there it is. <laughs> you missed it. That's right there, I see it, I see it, I see it. Oh, you want to walk? Yeah, 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 yeah,